Can you guys all see this? Okay, these are Instagram messages uh, from the Intrepid Candle Company, okay? Saying, can you go into Steph's stream as Sage? Now, remember, there was a troll account going around with the name Sage. The next one says, it's the only way they will leave my kids alone. If the morons get accused of trolling as my daughter. Okay. Then the next one says, these are messengers to the same people. I need, pe this is to the same person. This is all on their same phone. Okay. Because they, obviously this person didn't respond to the Instagram message. So she went over to messenger and she said, I need people to think they are trolling as Sage. Did you get my Instagram message? So let me read you the story now that uh, came with this. Let me read you the story that came with this because it's bothersome. And I can't really see the chat right now. But here's the person. So here's the person said, and they sent it anonymously. They sent it anonymously. Uh, they said, I'm sending this anonymously as I really don't want to be involved, but I have to let you know what I was sent. I'm in Laura's community and another woman in Patreon was being asked by Laura to troll as Laura's daughter. This was done privately between the two of them, but she told me that Laura was asking her to troll as her daughter and to make it look like it was coming from your side. She sent me all the messages, which I'm, I'm showing you right here. These are all the, these are all the notifications. Okay. Uh, she sent me all the messages, all the message notifications between herself and Laura. I'm sending you the notifications just so you know, I'm not lying. I cut out the date and time information only because it would narrow down who she asked to do this, uh, as it's a different time. Okay. No, no, no. I don't need to say all that because it's going to reveal more information. Uh, so then I said, uh, is it okay for, you know, am I allowed to show these? Is it okay for me to tell this story or whatever? And, um, she, uh, she said, I will ask if I can send you the rest as she sent me the actual full messages, uh, not just the notifications. So that whoever this person is has all of the, um, has all of the messages, not just these notifications. So I would really encourage that person to come forward. I can't see the chat right now, y'all. So if you're cussing me out, now's the chance to do it. Uh, whoever this person is, they have the full messages. I would really encourage you to come forward. And show these and be brave. I know that you're terrified and I'll get to why in a second. So she says, uh, I have canceled my membership with Laura and will be leaving her discord soon. I just don't want any backlash. Well, that's it's too late for that, sadly. Uh, so this person, whoever you are, anonymous, uh, you're safe with us. If you start to get backlash, let us know. Uh, she said, a few of us are leaving Patreon in the next few days. I'm shaking that she would use her children in this drama. All we ever wanted was to protect her children. How can we when she's the one putting them out there? So then I hadn't heard from her in a few days. And so I checked in with her today. I checked in with her today to see, you know, if everything was okay. Here, I'll put it right here so you guys can see. And I looked at this web, I looked at this on Instagram and it is her candle company. I mean, that is her page. So I don't see how these are fake, but, you know, maybe they are. I'm willing to look at any other evidence if someone has any. But listen to what she said today. Let me check in with the chat real quick. Let me check in with the chat real quick. Now, remember, she blamed us for this. She blamed us for this. She said that we were attacking her children. Exactly, Ash. No one was bothering her kids but her. And then, and then Unbone Capone got busted out, right, as that fake account. And then, of course, tried to deny it and blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Did you call CPS on yourself, too? Mmm. Mmm. Good question there, Ash. Good question. Okay, let me read the rest of this. Let me read the rest. Of, so y'all are picking up what I'm putting down. I'm glad. I'm glad. Let me read the rest of this because you guys will be amazed. And Unbone Capone, you suck. You suck. Stop harassing this woman. Let me read it to you. Listen, 
She says, I'm sorry I didn't respond. The person who sent me what Laura was doing has somewhat backed away. Oh, I'm sure she has. She's probably terrified. Uh, when I told her that I sent you some of what she was going on, she freaked out and told Laura. <laughs> Shit. I can't imagine how that conversation went. Uh, I'm guessing Laura thought it was all going to come out. So she is now not allowing new subs to comment in her streams. And she's trying to find another platform to stream on. And what did she just do recently? Remember, she said she's doing her $25 drama streams and looking for other um, looking for other platforms. So this checks out what this person is telling me. This checks out. So then she says uh, she's anticipating it all coming out. Yeah, yeah, boo. It's all coming out. Here it is. What she was getting her closest subs to do for her is the worst, most evil stuff imaginable. When it comes to using her children and family, I feel so defeated and have been getting sent nasty messages on Facebook from Capone asking why I would send you anything. So Capone is now harassing this person for telling me what the truth and vindicating our side, basically. We're being falsely accused of these nasty troll accounts of her of her children when it's her all along. And Capone's mad that their little their little uh, scheme got busted out. So he's sending harassing messages to this person. The count. OK, these are my messages. Here is this person. Here's the original right here, Laura, not in paint. Here's her message. I'm sending this anonymously as I really don't want to be involved. Blah, blah, blah. All the stuff I just read. All the stuff I just read. September 5th. And here I am. I accepted the request. See, I didn't, I wasn't following this person. So I said, okay, am I allowed to show this? And then, you know, or tell this story. Uh, this is, I could completely agree. This is something she would do. She's sick in the head and I stand by that. Uh, so here it is. You know, I will ask if I can. I already read all of these to you. I will ask if I can send the rest. Da da da. Here's all this. I am beyond disappointed. A few of us are leaving Patreon in the next few days. I am. I think she means shaking uh, that she would use her children. I already read all this to you guys. So this, as you can see, this is not in paint. This is a full. Uh, this is a full Twitter message. And I told her, you know, you're not the first person to say that. And I'm like, anything you can give me that will prove what you're saying. Because, you know, this could be this could be fake. I'm willing to believe that maybe this is fake. Or at that time I was. And then I said, did, you know, did you get permission? I uh, just wanted to check on you. And then here she is. Here's This is what she said today. That she's getting nasty messages from stupid Unbone Capone. There it is. Asking me why I would send you anything. All my friends have turned on me. None of them care what Laura is doing. They back her blindly, even when she's hurting her own family. I don't understand it. You have my permission to share my story. I hope maybe it incites someone to come forward. Do you think it might? And then I was like, who are you? You know, like, you might as well tell us now. Who are you? I really want to help. Uh, if you're willing to come tell your story, I know you will get support, including the harassment from Capone, that fucker. I can't stand that henchman. <laughs> And then I said, I was wondering why she went silent. And that's that's what that's why, because she knew that this was going to come out. And I said, I'd love to expose that asshole too, meaning Capone. Uh, if you would ever let me show you show his harassing messages to you, please know I will keep your name private or whatever you need me to do to help protect you. Okay? So there. That is not in Microsoft Paint or Windows Paint or whatever it is. Okay? I pulled it into Paint. Because it docks Laura's last name in the in the iPhone notifications, right here, and the and the messenger notifications. Okay, that's why. So hopefully that clears that part up. Uh, I'm sad that that's what she's uh, deciding to talk about when she was just busted out with this shit. 